morning friends today we are going to see the proximate analysis the proximate analysis is used to determine the fixed percentage of the carbon in the coal sample to know the fixed carbon one should know the value of moisture volatile matter ash content and hence one can easily calculate fixed carbon present in the coal sample let's see how they are calculated like moisture volatile matter ash content and how one can know the fixed carbon so for moisture take 1 gram of fine powdered coal sample in a crucible here is a picture of a crucible where we can see in this crucible we are going to take 1 gram of coal sample after that the crucible is kept in an electric hot air oven where the temperature is about 105 to 110 degrees celsius now this crucible is kept there for 1 hour and then it is removed with the help of pair of tongs then it is cooled in a desiccator and way so here we see the desiccator where we can keep the crucible and cool it after cooling we can take the weight of it so this was about the moisture and here we see how it is calculated the percentage of moisture is equals to loss in weight upon weight of the coal taken into 100 by this method we are going to calculate the percentage of moisture now the volatile matter the take the crucible a which we have seen previous for the moisture take the same crucible with the same coal sample which is left in it and then cover the crucible with the lid so this crucible is then covered after that keep the crucible in the electric furnace that is the muffle furnace at a temperature 925 plus minus 20 degrees celsius then keep it for 7 minute cool it in a desiccator so this is your desiccator where we have to keep this crucible and we have to cool it and then take the weight of it so here the percentage of volatile matter is equals to we see loss in weight due to removal of volatile matter upon weight of the coal sample taken into 100 so this was about the calculation of the volatile matter now let's see about the ash content so take the same crucible like which we have taken for a then for b and Uh, take this for C also. That is for the ash content. We are going to take the same crucible with the same coal sample in that which is being present for the moisture or for the volatile matter. F from that one gram of the coal sample, we are just calculating the moisture, the volatile matter, and now we are going to calculate the ash content. So the same crucible with the same uh, coal sample in it, by which we have determined, as I have already told you, the moisture. the volatile matter so the same crucible is here then keep the crucible in the furnace without lid so here is the crucible uh, where we cannot see the lid it is uncovered over here uh, at a temperature of about 700 plus minus 50 degrees celsius then we are going to keep it for half hour that is for 30 minute we are going to keep it in the furnace after that we are going to cool it in a desiccator and then we are going to take its weight now this procedure like uh, here we can see heating cooling and weighing these three things means we are going to heat it 
we are going to cool it and then we are going to take its weight we are going to repeat this till we get the constant reading means we are repeating the same procedure till we get the constant reading that is the constant weight and hence we can calculate the percentage of the ash content like weight of the ash left upon weight of the coal sample taken into 100 so the fixed carbon will be 100 minus percentage of moisture plus volatile matter plus ash content so this was all about it thank you